I'll guide you through how to adjust your screen size on OBS. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like and let's do this. I'll be covering a few different ways you can go and adjust your screen in OBS. So the first way is just going to be adjusting the preview screen itself. So perhaps you're trying to add a webcam and multiple other layers. So you want this just to be bigger. So to adjust that, all you need to do is place your cursor in this black bar above scenes, sources, audio mixer, screen transition and controls. When you hover your cursor there, it's going to go and switch to an arrow pointing up and down. Then you can go and hold on the left mouse button and then just go and drag it up and down like so to make it the size you'd like. The second thing you may want to go and change the size off is your actual recording. So you may have a webcam here or you may just have your screen like mine. So if that's the case, all you need to do is go and click on the source, which you want to go and adjust. So in this case, I want to go and adjust the display capture. And when you go and click on the source, it will then go and outline it. So if I had a webcam, for example, in the top left, you'd see a red outline there, but I've just got a display capture. Then all you need to do is go and drag on one of the moving points, as you can see there in the corners and in the middle, and then just hold and drag and you can make it the size you'd like. And if you go and hold a button like shift, you can then go and uh, sort of squish it a bit more and it loses aspect ratio. And the final thing I'd like to show you is that you can actually go and change the resolution of this preview screen here as well. To do that, you need to go and click on settings in the control section, and then you can go down to video on the left hand side, and you can then go and choose the base canvas, which is what this is here. And you can also go and choose what you actually record to, which is the output scaled resolution. So you can go and change both of these to whatever you'd like. Then make sure you click apply in the bottom right and that'll be saved. So I hope you did find this useful. If you did, please consider leaving a like. Peace.